But what do the, um, the elements actually look like themselves? So let's have a look at the, the uh, group one metals. Well, here is lithium. So it's a solid. It's a metal. It looks slightly sort of black some parts here, but the rest of it is sort of silvery colored, typical metal. So there's lithium. We have some sodium here. So here is some sodium. Again, very shiny metal. We have potassium. Here's some potassium. Again, just a shiny silvery metal. And here is rubidium. There's rubidium in the bottom of the tube here. Again, another shiny metal. And finally, we have some cesium. And Chris has been keeping this uh, nice and warm by holding it. Uh, and it's actually melted. Okay? So this really is quite beautiful. This is it's like liquid gold. This is a golden colored. So it's still a metal, but actually it uh, melts just above room temperature. So just by holding it, uh, we can see, this, uh, see it turn to a liquid. Okay, so this is cesium metal. So that's what they look like. They're all metals, okay, all shiny metals. Well, all apart from one. The one at the top of the group is not a metal at all. This is the one at the top of the group. This is hydrogen. And of course, hydrogen isn't a metal, it's a gas. Okay, so very different indeed. But on this planet, and this is the planet Jupiter, well, Jupiter is mainly made up of hydrogen, and it's thought that in the centre of Jupiter, under all the pressure there, the hydrogen that there is, is squashed and squashed and squashed, and initially we get uh, solid hydrogen, but if we keep squashing it, we end up with metallic hydrogen. So it, Jupiter is thought to consist of a metallic core. So right in the heart of this is metallic hydrogen. Now, it's very, very difficult to get these pressures here on Earth, but it has been done in one experiment. They managed to squash hydrogen enough using a diamond anvil, and then they measured the conductivity, and it turns out to be pretty much the same as the other Group 1 elements. So hydrogen, yes, is very different, but uh, under the right circumstances, maybe it's possible to get it uh, to be just like a metal as well.